Now, let's think about that for a second in the middle of this quote. You got Caesar's domain, you got that which is between the individual and God. Is the body temple part of Caesar's domain? Do we render, let's think about this. Jesus said, render unto Caesar that which is Caesar's. Render unto Caesar that which bears Caesar's image, the coin he was holding. Render unto God that which bears God's image. Think about the scriptures on the body and and what we've recently just been through. Offer your bodies as a living what? Sacrifice. That's worship language. The body is the temple of the Holy Spirit. Worship language. Whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do it all to the glory of God. Worship language. So we say with all respect and honor due to the authorities in their proper domain that worship spiritual choices must be left to the individual. And if somebody comes along and says, well, you've got a bad conscience in saying you want to not take that or whatever, and and you may not appeal to conscience on that matter, they've just negated the whole concept of conscience by declaring what is and what is not conscience. And it is the refuge of tyrants. How about we finish the rest of the quote? They're going to give a new conception of government through the schools of the world. And what is this conception? It's It's a conception that will embrace all the activities of men. We would call that totalitarian government. And it will, it will postulate the need of scientific control. 